you see sometimes in life a lot of things can happen and most of the time you you won't know when it's gonna come so prepare for the unexpected expect the unexpected what does that mean okay just expect for something that could happen in the future but the problem with this thing is that most people get caught up in it so this is where anxiety comes so um <clears throat> if you guys didn't know uh things that happen in the past give you depression if you stay in the past so you keep thinking about it things in the future um if you think about it too much and you're scared of it then that's anxiety and then yeah, if you live in the present which is now like this exact moment uh you'll you'll find peace and freedom because it's like you're not really worried about anything so Live in the present. Don't think about the future. Don't think about the past. Of course, have goals. But, yeah, I mean, like, from your past, you should learn lessons, right? From the future, you should plan to actually move up. And and the present is where you deal with everything and uh, you move up in life, right? Or go down. But you're supposed to move up. <clears throat> so... Expect the unexpected. I'm not gonna lie, I almost forgot the whole topic of the video, but um, you should expect the unexpected. Why do I say this? It's uh, because a lot of things, especially now, like like if you guys know what's going on, it, it's crazy. And I really can't talk about it because it's like, you know? Um, what do I mean by this? So, Okay, I'll probably make another video about this, but pack a bag that has enough clothes for a week, at least like three, four days. That's what I do. And when I mean a pack, I mean like if you can some water, but I mean clothes like shoes, uh, jackets, uh, shirts, pants, socks, underwear, maybe an extra phone, portable charger. Actually, I don't have one uh, in my thing, but I do have a charger to the plug so i think i'm gonna have to put one in there but i have like another backup stuff you know what i mean um prepare for unexpected a lot of things that happen uh so save some money if you can uh you can so save some money have some backup clothes uh have some people that you can uh trust i guess but be careful because your enemies what's the saying it's like your enemy keep your friends close but your enemies closer yeah i don't know but basically what i'm saying is just don't don't trust everyone prepared prepare for what's gonna come because we don't know what's gonna come i mean some of us do but not everyone knows prepare for unexpected they're coming one day they might do something one of these days so you just got to prepare try to get in shape back up clothes food water try to have all your water like like a hydro flask type container um don't leave it in plastic it's gonna kill you um um i guess canned food it's not the best but it will it'll last you a while um just try to have a little bit of everything a little pocket knife if you can um let me see what else it sounds like a survival guide huh it's not the i mean kind of but yeah just be prepared a lot of things are coming i don't know when i told myself i was going to prepare back in like 2016 so like seven years ago now did I prepare or no? So sad. I forgot all about that plan. I think about it maybe once a year. It's like, damn. Could have been some monster right now. Killing machine. Just prepare. Food, water, resources. Some type of some type of way to like exchange value so money uh gold silver jewelry maybe some items electronics 
Um, just anything that holds value, try to have that on you, just in case, you know. Money, currency, is literally what people say currency is. Back in the day, it used to be gold, sometimes food, weapons. Right now, it's cash. Let me show you. You know, I didn't want to be a guy, but okay. Cash. Cash is what holds value right now. It was crypto for a bit. But you just got to be careful. You never know. Take care of yourself. Take care of your family. Show God the beauty of its creations. This is Tori Blue. Remember, it's all for you. It's all for you. Mm. Make sure to like, subscribe. Text me on Instagram. If you made it this far, thank you. Like, subscribe. Follow me on my Instagram. Text me. Coaching calls, any type of calls. Just hit me up on Instagram. Alright, I'll see you. Take care. Bye.